Hello, so I've got my camera resting against the thing and it's kind of awkward, I don't know how perfect it is, but um, yeah, uh, it's been a while since I made a vlog, sort of, not really a while, but it's been a little while because I have been quite, well not really busy, but I've been playing a lot of WoW with Daniel, because I'm playing on the American servers now, so I'm playing with Daniel on that, and also um, because he's in America, I'm pretty much living in American time, so I'm kind of delayed. And I keep waking up late and all that stuff, so I haven't really had time to make a vlog or whatever, but it's enough excuses anyway. Um, <laughs> like a horse. Um, I didn't get no sleep last night, so yeah, I'm not really in a hyper mood though, I'm just... My cat is making sounds of me. I'm not really in a hyper mood, I'm just kind of... What's the word? I don't know, I'm kind of divide at the moment, I'm just, nah. So I don't know how fun this is going to be. <laughs> um, what do I want to say? I didn't really want to say anything particular, I just wanted to make a vlog, so I'm just going to speak. Um, and it will form some kind of sense as it goes along, I guess. So the first thing I want to talk about, because it's on my mind, is California. And I know I keep talking about it a lot. But that's because I'm really excited, despite my lack of enthusiasm in my voice there, but I am excited to go there to see him. And I know I keep talking about it a lot. And the thing is, um, I don't know if you remember from a few videos ago, but I mentioned that Danielle recently had surgery, quite significant surgery, and obviously he's recovering now. And I can't get there until he gets a bit better. So, um, because, I mean, I know I could, like, travel to him as well, and if I could just appear there, then I would straight away but what I've got to do is I've got to travel from my house to Merthyr and then I've got to go from Merthyr to London Heathrow and then I've got to fly from Heathrow to LAX I would go straight to San Diego but it cost way too much to go there like that so I'll be flying from Heathrow to LAX and then obviously I've got to get from LA to San Diego and that's where he comes in and I'm gonna be overwhelmed enough and I don't really want to get like buses and all that shit extra cause you know it's just, it's just going to be too much for me, I think, then. So I need to wait for him to get a bit better. Hopefully it'll be soon, because... If it starts stretching past August, then... It's going to be quite awkward, because I've got uni in September. Although it is at the end of September, so we've got a little while left, like a month left, and then it's, I'm just going to have to like not go. So hopefully it does get better soon. Um, another thing I want to talk about was WoW. Um, I did want to do, like, gameplay stuff for a while. And then as I was thinking about it, I realised that it would take way too much effort to do, like, a guide for WoW because it's so big. So I decided against that. Um, on the gaming channel, it's kind of sporadic because I've still got PC problems. Today was terrible. This morning was terrible because it was just shutting down, like, consecutively. But I think I've narrowed the problem down and I believe it's my memory. Um, there are some memory problems every now and again. And the thing with this problem is, I've had it since I've had the PC. But it's so sporadic, like it can be fine for months. And then it can just break and then be fine again. It's, it's just weird. Um, but later on, or oh, actually I'll probably be sleeping later because I'm really tired. Probably tomorrow or tonight. Tonight or tomorrow, I will open it up and clean it all out, which is never fun, but you got to do it if you got a PC. And this shit, um, I've also got to buy suitcases, and I've recently bought a suit for my auntie's wedding in October. So that's nice. I, I don't really wear formal attire. It's not my thing. I'm more of a casual dressed person. So yeah, I hate suits, but I bought something that's kind of suiting to me, and it's still formal looking, so it'll be okay. Although I won't be wearing shoes or a tie. I'll probably be like black converse. I can hear people shouting outside and I'll punch them. Um, what else do I want to say to you? Oh yeah, there's a problem with the software that I had. Um, it turns out that it's only for Mac. So I got a PC so I can't obviously, I can't use that. So I need to find something else that's capable of doing what I needed to do. So, excuse me, um, for Q&A 11. I'll just make it bog standard on... what's the day? What day is it? Let's check. 
What day is it? Friday. Gotta get down on Friday. <laughs> if I was in fact. Um, I'll probably do it tomorrow and upload it on Sunday. So yeah, there's quite a few questions from the various sources. And if you do want to ask a question for Q&A 12, um, you can leave us a video response in the moderator module of the channel on Twitter or Facebook. You can find all the information in the description bar below. And um, yeah, weather today is quite shit. It's currently overcast, bits of sun, but it was pissing down earlier, like, tr tr I was going to say tremendous rain, torrential rain. But yeah, I just want to talk because I haven't spoken for a while and I just want to... Oh, also, um... I've had Narina Palo's new album, Year of the Wolf, and I strongly recommend you get it. First of all, I recommend you check it out. The favourite song, my favourite, one of my favourite songs in the album is called History Boys. I'll pop a link to, to her acoustic version of that song. It's on YouTube, um, but there somewhere. And you can check that out, and I'll pop a link to This Will Be Our Year, which is another acoustic one she sang on her channel up there. Check them out, and if you like them, I hope you do, because uh, she's a, a proper lyrical singer. She, um, her words mean something, and she composes all the music herself, and she produces it well, and she sings beautifully. I, I, I adore the woman. Um, and if you do check out the videos, subscribe if you like them, and tell her that I sent you. Say Drew11189 sent you. And you love her music. Um, yeah. And yeah, I'll move you now, because... Ah, shit, I'm stuck. Okay. So, um... Oh, wrong one. So, yeah, that is History Boys. It's a song written about war and more particularly um how it is bad and i don't know if you know narina palo but she started off her career with a song called everybody's going to war and that was more in anger at war and all that stuff and this song is more about sadness because when you listen to the acoustic version bear in mind she's pregnant when she sang it and she's singing about these governmental people sending people's sons to go to war and die and as she's got a son, she's singing him with such emotion that it's just, it's just beautiful. So, yeah, um, I'll stop talking about Marina Palo now, because you've probably heard enough of her. Look at such Jane, you comfy, love? You comfy by my side? Yeah. And, um, am I comfy? Yes, you can't even see my tan here, this sucks. Okay, nice stretch. <laughs> um, so, yeah. I can't think of anything else I wanted to say. Uh, was there something else I wanted to say? I can't remember. I got distracted by Narina Palo. So, yeah, check out those videos. Um, they're really good, and look, out, look at her other one. She's got like four albums out. So, look at them all, and um, yeah, got itchy nipple. If you wanted to know that, I don't know why you would. Um, I can't think of anything I want to say, so I'll just leave you go. Yeah. So, um... Oh, God, this is too comfortable. So I will see you, little munchings, sometime soon with the next vlog, and Q&A sooner, probably, unless I think for something else I want to say. Also, my lights keep blowing and that pisses me off because now I've got one light. Because I got like spotlights, look. I got spotlights. And only one of them is working now, so it's like a really gloomy ambience in my room in the night and it's just peculiar. It's like a seductive slash gloomy ambience and it's odd. Ambiance. <laughs> Should I speak properly? <sighs> but yeah. I don't know what I'm doing, so I will leave you go, and thank you for watching, remember to subscribe if you aren't already, uh, like, post a comment, comment, question of the video can be, if you check out Narina Palo, if you already know her, what do you think of her music? 
I, for one, absolutely fucking love it. <laughs> and yeah. Oh yeah, uh, my Ask the Audience thing has gone quite successful too. It's quite a lot of interaction from you guys, so that's nice. Um, bye! I didn't realise this video was so bloody long. Well done me for just pulling out of the hard right? And it flowed too, quite well. Congratulations! Okay, so um, I'll do a little shake. I got lots of... I got lots of like zips or zippers if you're American on my jeans. So when I shake, I sound like I'm doing a fucking samba or something like Shakira bobbling about the place. <laughs> okay, see you. I will drink my coffee and then I will go to bed and then I will wake up. Yeah, bye. Also, I like miming if I'm on the camera because I don't like to sing to people. I sing to myself or passively to my mother <laughs> to her dismay. But yeah, if, if I if I ever show you songs, you notice I mime a lot, and I think I do it quite well actually. What do you think? What do you think about my mime? Leave a comment. I don't believe you're going because this is I'm rambling and I'm getting a bit sporadic and I'm something dance around the place like Shakira. So I'll see you the next episode soon. It's not an episode, it's a vlog, and I'll see you the Q and A on Saturday or Sunday. Okay, okay. Thank you.